All right, it's day 34. I now have only four iron plates instead of the original eight. I've rearranged everything in my living room. The brighter light is now on the right. I want these two vines to fall to the right eventually, although there's no sign of anything falling over at this point. The stems are so thick. The cotyledons for this front plant have started to be cannibalized. This original true leaf used to be so green, that's being cannibalized as well and that leaf just had a leaf defect but as you can see there are two male flowers that have bloomed and flower primordia vine offshoot here and you know just all sorts of activity occurring at every single meristem it's amazing what having 16 hours of light a day can do you can see the top of a tendril there and this is the bottom of the second plant you know the one behind it's got primordial activity you know, this uh, vine offshoot is actually one of the oldest, the oldest, I think, but it doesn't have enough light to really develop well. It'll probably only get flowers, and this is the first true leaf of the back plant. I haven't given them names. The front plant has a more developed tendril. They each have one tendril. It's amazing how the tendrils have come much later after the appearance of flowers. It takes a few days for the flower primordia to really ramp up here, but as you can see, each plant now has dozens of flowers in the works. So this is a close-up of the first male flower. And I think they stay open for 48 hours, maybe 36 at the most. Now with my experience with honeydew last year, this is the second flower. These are male flowers, so I don't need to do anything. I don't need to do anything until female flowers come out. And if you're new to honeydew and you're wondering what female flowers look like, don't worry. You'll know when you see them. They have huge uh, pre-melons behind them and they take a while to open so as long as I keep monitoring the situation in my living room I really don't have to do anything for another few days just reposition this thing and wait for flowers